Hey guys, what's up? Bisectatron here from One Hive Gazette here with the next video and uh, we're taking a look at bowlers being used to 3 star at Town Hall 10. This is actually one of my attacks and uh, pretty solid base but the bowler walk got it done. So we're going to take a look at the attack, talk a little bit about uh, how bowlers could be used as a, actually a 3 star uh, part of an attack moving forward in Clash of Clans. So let's go ahead and get it started though. Uh, you can see I'm bringing 7 healers which is ridiculous but um, it, it's necessary because I'm doing also my, a queen walk with just my regular queen. So I need the three healers on the bowlers. And one thing to note um, as this winds down, because I took a little, a few seconds to uh, get my bearings before I attacked, there I go. But one thing to note is that the bowlers, I, the healers do more for them than they do for the queen because there's the reduced heal uh, on, the, on the heroes that the healers do. So bringing three will keep them up and almost any circumstance you don't really need four sometimes even two is fine so the three bowlers go in uh, the max ones from the CC which is so four level three bowlers then the queen walk on the other side this is just making a funnel for my Valks and that's what it's all about at Town Hall 10 on especially in these types of like ring bases you've seen it a bunch on the channel trying to make this uh, this little pathway for your Valks to enter into the base so the queen's gonna step up right there, drop the poison, she'll take out the defensive queen. I actually, I saw her getting low out of the corner of my eye and pop the ability. I really didn't need to at that point because she was getting healed back up, but went ahead and did it anyway. And then I'll have to drop the rage to keep her up over the CC troops. Uh, poison for the balloon and the dragons. That'll get them down. And the bowlers actually kind of went around and now they're on the wall right there, which is just fine because they'll meet up with my Valks. So they'll kind of continue on in the attack which is awesome. Uh, you can see right there the jump goes down and the path has been cleared for the Valks to make their way into the middle, have the rage, the freeze, and the heal, and uh, these Valks are gonna be through the base in no time. Uh, the heal will keep them pretty much at full health throughout this entire core. Uh, they are taking quite a bit of damage now from the rest of the uh, skeleton of the base, but uh, the bowlers have gone back out of the base. Or they, they were never really in the core, but they're back around kind of towards the air defense there. Uh, you can see them doing some work as they're behind that Valk. The queen is still making her way through. Uh, cheeky little balloon right there. And uh, the Valks are still at pretty solid health because, uh, and you'll see the healers actually get on the Valks in a minute, uh, which helps even more. The, so I had, I think, set, yeah, seven healers. So uh, definitely going to have a lot of end game healing because not all of them are shot down by air defenses. And uh, right here, everything's pretty much back to full health uh, thanks to those healers and uh, finishing up these last few buildings. So very encouraging. Obviously not, not the highest level base. I mean, the defenses were pretty solid, but uh, wasn't the best layout, I guess. Not an anti three star layout. And uh, that is true, but keep in mind, I only have like level 31, 30 heroes and um, some of my troops aren't maxed out. So there's a lot of potential, I think, for bowlers if you can get the right base for them and just have them clear out a compartment and let the queen take out a compartment on the other side and send the Valks in the middle. So anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that attack. Um, I'm having fun using the bowlers and uh, hopefully I can incorporate them into a bit of a closer war. Uh, for those of you guys who want to recap against Barbarian Bowl, I mean, all the great attacks are in that Q&A if you want to go back and watch them. So I didn't feel like I could really get enough attacks uh, besides that for the uh, recap video. So I'm not going to do a recap, unfortunately, but good job to, Bar to Barbarian Bull. Uh, the clash with Cam Clan, I believe, uh, was a fun war. So anyway, thanks for watching, and maybe you guys can use bowlers in some of your attacks or let your fellow Town Hall 10s, uh, your clan mates that are Town Hall 10s, know about it. Uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye, Sectatron out.